It's immunization week. Have you taken all the required vaccines? All the vaccines? I've taken none. Vaccines are not safe. What do you mean vaccines are not safe? Experts call it one of the best innovations of the 20th century. According to World Health Organization estimates, currently vaccines prevent 3.5 to 5 million deaths every year from diseases like diphtheria, tetanus, whooping cough, influenza and measles. Please. I've seen it online. There are a lot of people suggesting against vaccines because they have toxins and they can cause real side effects. My friend, you are blinded by myths. Tell me what you've heard and I will fact check it for you. Okay, I'm ready. So here's the first one. Vaccines cause infertility and they can even make you important. This is a widely circulated rumor. However, The Indian Ministry of Health and Family Welfare has emphasized that no credible studies support this claim, noting vaccines do not interact with reproductive systems. Um, okay, but you can't deny that natural immunity is better than vaccines. Another myth. Research has shown that natural immunity wanes faster and poses higher risks. A 2023 Nature study found vaccinated individuals had lower hospitalization rates than those relying on natural immunity, especially during Omicron surges. But um, don't vaccines alter DNA? Misinformation about mRNA technology has fueled fears of genetic modification. Scientists have clarified that COVID-19 vaccines do not enter cell nuclei or interact with DNA. with mrna degrading within days and that's another myth fine all those may have been wrong but you can't deny that vaccines cause autism i've heard it so many times from so many people this is a myth that has been around since the 1990s and refuses to die down despite multiple evidence to the contrary it started with a study that was published in the lancet that claimed that there was a link between measles mumps and rubella vaccine and autism however this study was later exposed as flawed and unethical and lancet even retracted the study in 2010 multiple studies have debunked these claims since then and found that there was no link between the vaccine and autism so now do you believe that vaccines offer the dose of protection and that they are certainly for your best yeah i'll go get all the necessary shots now god so many needles Well, that little pinch is certainly worth the protection that it offers. So you should get your jabs too. Stay tuned to First Check for more fact checks on health-related topics because, as always, health matters, facts matter.